the formidable robots. I have fond memories of using Windows XP, and one of my favorite features was choosing my own profile picture. I had a few favorites, like the rubber duck, the fish, and the red flower, but my most beloved was the rubber frog. It was a simple image of a squeaky rubber frog bath toy. Recently, people on the internet have been trying to find the origins of this frog, but all efforts have come up empty. The earliest known appearance, aside from being a profile picture, was in a Russian news article. Others include an HD version of the image, a couple of stock photos, and a spot in the Columbia University image library, grouped with other items. There's even a 360 degree gif of it. As I delved deeper into the mystery, I found some major information. The company behind this iconic image, Squeaky Creations Incorporated, was founded in 1997. They were known for making squeaky rubber bath toys based on popular media and other themes. Their most iconic designs, just to name a few, ranged from cartoons, anime, and video games, with two of their most successful video game-related lines being Pokemon and Kirby. They also produced animal designs, as they made rubber ducks, rubber penguins, rubber clownfish, rubber flamingos, and most notably, the rubber frog used as the Windows profile picture. In the early years, Squeaky Creations Inc. wasn't globally famous, but they had a niche following in the United States. Kids and teens bought their toys to keep in boxes, play with in the bath, use as stress toys, or give to their dogs. The company was a success, until their decline in 2006. A 14-year-old boy in the ninth grade bought a rubber frog from his local Walmart using his chore money. He intended to display it with his collection of rubber squeak toys, the next day, he discovered that it had been taken out of the box and placed on his desk. His parents denied any involvement. Thinking it was a prank, he bought another frog toy and gave the first one to his dog. But the new frog was also out of its box the next day. Accepting the condition of the toy, he put it back with the rest of his collection. That night, the entire family was murdered. The dog survived, found lying on a neighbor's porch. When police arrived, they discovered the boy's rubber squeak toy collection was gone, leaving only the empty boxes on the shelves. From that incident onward, anyone who bought one of these toys was murdered the following day. The company faced numerous lawsuits and eventually went out of business. The toys disappeared, rumored to still be in the abandoned factory where they were made. In 2008, a new company called, Joyful Squeaks Limited, emerged, making rubber squeak toys based on popular media. This new company had no connection to the previous one and had a better reputation, producing toys based on newer series at the time like Angry Birds and Plants vs. Zombies. They continue to make toys today. However, it's theorized that Squeaky Creations Inc.'s toys were sentient and sought revenge on humans for being abused and trapped in boxes. Some people believe this theory, despite its absurdity. Thinking back to my days with Windows XP and my favorite profile picture, I can't help but feel a chill. Was there something more to that image than just a cute bath toy? The origins remain a mystery, but the dark history of Squeaky Creations Inc. adds a darker side to my nostalgia.